Senegal International Airport, St. Vincent and the Grenadines. This is history, a major game changer. We're gonna show you what's happening inside. We've got a tour to show you, so stick around for that. with the recent announcement of our open day things are pretty hectic we we're talking about concessions being finalized advertising wall spaces being determined and so forth so there's a lot of buzz around the airport at this time and we're just really excited to see it slowly coming together yeah truthfully it's a lot of hard work but i mean this, this is st vincent and the Grandin's biggest national project so we're looking forward to getting it off of the ground right now we're in full gear for promotions of course you know the opening date is February 14th and as Tabia oh, said it's a lot of hard work because you have to get concessionaries in place okay advertisers in place right so, so they're looking they're looking <laughs> so so let's get things going for yeah. sure um, okay awesome so let's let's go around a little bit they're gonna show us some more of uh, what people will see once they arrive so we'll, we'll be checking back in so this is okay we are right now inside the new Argyle International Airport. This is sort of the check-in area. It's slated to open soon and this is where people will be coming if you stayed in St. Vincent and you're traveling back to wherever you are. So beautiful color scheme of green and yellow. It looks super shiny, very nice and cool. When you would check in, you used to show your passport, you know the usual procedure. Okay. And then now we will be heading this way to board security checkpoint. Got it. Okay. Right. Okay. So you line up for immigration. Yes. So then here we are having what? This is where you would show your passports and everything, your boarding pass and so forth, just before you head to get checked. Okay. Checked. Cool. No, we're fine. It's fine. We're looking. We're like eavesdropping on a door. Security. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, what? so, right, so after the security checkpoint, then you know, you take off your shoe, you put through your luggage for check in. Okay, you know, so you have your. Where I know this is the departure you know, lounge. Yes. Is yes. there a bar? Mommy wants to know what the bar is. The, bar? <laughs> <laughs> the international departure area. Let me just yes. give you a quick swivel around and then we'll get some specifics from Tabia. So lots of green as you can see because of the colors and you know, there's a little you can hang out here, have something to eat. Yeah. I like it, it's nice and yeah. breezy. Yeah. Nice really and open. open, yeah. And it's comfortable, because as you can see at our food court, this area here. Okay. You know, you have your different options of seating. Oh, here's the seating and the food court area behind us. Okay. Cool, you have a few monitors and stuff there, and then once you're leaving, you go from you yes, know, exit. You exit. Down the, what do you call it? The, the jet, jet bridge. The jet bridge. <laughs> the jet bridge. It's a little overexposed because of the light, but we'll get a little closer. See? Imagine. There. This is what it would look like when you just arrived. You come through the doors, you turn around, your family is waiting for you. Oh, oh hi! Hi! <laughs> That's what it's going to be like. You're going to come out here, and then you go on your merry way. Isn't that cool? This is major. This is major for St. Vincent. It's going to mark. 
mark the next level um, of, of you know opportunities for the island St. Vincent and the Grenadines and it's gonna mean a whole lot for us who, who live in the diaspora and uh, Vincentians abroad who have been so many people have been reaching out saying I can't wait for the airport to to open so that I can come back home and not that you can't come now but it's huge it's major so this is pretty exciting